everyone, Bob is in the house. Just woke up to listen to Anita's banger, new song. Uh, what was it called? Will I see you? Damn. <laughs> uh, the Instagram posts, I have seen them yesterday. You know, she teased me a lot and uh, there was like great visuals. So let's just go ahead and check it out. Anita, Pooh Bear, probably EDM track if there's Pooh Bear. <laughs> Uh, will I see you? First reaction. Let's go. When it's all said and done, will I see you? Okay. When it's all said and done, said and done, she's making a very beautiful video, like with it, as like she's an angel or something like that, you know, she's with a be very beautiful soul. <laughs> Special focus on her butt. That's that's nice. <laughs> Damn, Anita. Mm. Okay. Hey. Wow. Yeah, she's very beautiful here, and uh, not only here, always. But this is different from Anita. I. I don't remember seeing her with a soulful track, with a calm track. It was always more a beat, like dancing track, but here it's like. Tum, tum. And she's speaking in English. That's nice. Oh, dancing. Salsa. <laughs> Great video, just very pleasant, very chill, very nice, very soulful delivery by Anita, and the uh, visuals were great as well. At this point, you know, like, uh, I should not, like, there is no point of me telling that, oh yeah, that was sexy, though, because Anita always provides us with some uh, sexy material on her videos. And you know whether you like it or not, it's it's working for her. I actually surprised that it was an EDM track, by the way, because Pooh Bear was collaborating with Skrillex uh, recently uh, on the song "Would You Ever," and uh, I thought that I thought that Pooh Bear is probably maybe just another DJ or something like that, but no, uh, probably like I have seen the guy over there with the guitar in the video, so maybe that's him. So. Um, yeah, that's just a surprise for me uh, that the track was actually that uh, relaxing, like a calm song, right? Rather than uh, dancing Anita, right? Paradinha, stuff like that. So, um, yeah, I like it. I love it. And Anita, her um, um, choice to sing in English. It was very bold choose because uh, <laughs> it was a very bold choice because as you see, for example, me even like I struggle sometimes with speaking English. Just sometimes, you know, I'm I consider myself fluent in English already, but still I'm not that good speaker still. So, um, and Anita maybe she knows English a little worse than me, you know, and her singing in English and making an English track, I mean, uh, the track in English, it's very nice, very nice of her, very bold decision, very good decision as well in terms of business, because uh, right now Anita's name is popping not only in South American uh, world, not in only Latinas world, but also around the world, whole world, and, um, and she's making an uh, English track to make sure that the international success will be there uh, because so that everyone can understand, you know, so that everyone 
can relate to the songs, and especially calm songs, you know. Uh, everyone has that vulnerable side of uh, you, or like just chilling side of you that wants to like vibe into calming songs. That's why R&B is so popular as well, and uh, pop songs usually use very relaxing songs. I don't know how to say, uh, I don't know how to describe those kind of songs. Not relaxing, but like, you know, Bruno Mars, Ed Sheeran type of deal. So, yeah, that's about it. I'm kind of talking too much already. Uh, thank you guys for watching. I love you guys. And hopefully I will see you guys in the next videos. Bye. Oh. <laughs> Пока. Хайер, ау фидерзейн, арвидерчи, адиос, чао, чао, амивар, ор офис, гудбай. Бай. Ааа, дэм. I gotta concentrate. It's not working well today. My brain is not working well today. One more time. Пока. Хайер, ау фидерзейн, арвидерчи, адиос, чао, чао, амивар, ор офис, гудбай. Yeah.